welcome to my channel if you're new or welcome back to the hot mess that is my channel if you are a repeat offender no <laughs> sure <laughs> today we have something a little we have a story time um yeah this is like one that's too crazy to be real but you, this is like one of those things where you can't make this shit up okay uh yeah okay so i guess let's start back back at the beginning <laughs> okay so how the story starts is i was at a friend's house and you know uh, I woke up and it was like 10 p.m. I'll be just keep it 100 with you. And she lives in downtown Vancouver. I moved away from there. And so I called her. Right. I, was, uh, I don't know why. She made some bomb ass pasta, which I had a little bit of before I passed out. And I woke up and I was like, oh my god, I really want pasta. And so, like, I called friend. I was like, Shit. Should I say? Okay, I have friends. You can guess which one. Uh, and if you know, mind your business. Okay. So yeah. So I call friends. And I'm like, uh yeah. So I'm downtown. I figured, you know, I want pasta. I'll buy his fucking pasta, whatever. I just want to come over and hang out with you. And he's like, I'm not at home right now. And I'm like, I don't give a fuck. I'll wait. I'll wait up for you. He's like, okay, sure. So, uh, for some fucking reason, I figured the, f the food's gonna take way longer than, you know, the, the Uber, the, you know, and it's not, a f it's like a 10 minute drive, right? So I'm like, the, the food's gonna take longer. So while I'm at my friend's house, like before I leave, I order the food to friend's house. Thinking like, okay, so then we'll, it'll arrive probably at the same time. So my friend is vegetarian, so I order like a like a bougie vegetarian pizza this is like a bougie like Italian place I ordered a, like a $20 shrimp alfredo chicken pasta and then I ordered like a shrimp Caesar salad and a Greek salad and I ordered like $70 worth of food and I'm like yeah my friend I'm gonna go to town you know like I just wanted to like hang out friend. with her I'm like oh shit's gonna be awesome think nothing of, nothing of it, right? Or we ordered the food. And then I order the, well actually I I went to or, I went to order an Uber, but I have Lyft as well. So yeah, this is some tea. I went to go order, like I have both apps and sometimes I like to compare like what is gonna be cheaper. And for whatever reason, Lyft was like $5 cheaper. So I was like, okay, I'll just order a Lyft, right? So I ordered the Lyft. And I order, it's like, the guy's gonna be 10 minutes. I'm like, oh shit, okay, whatever. And like literally before the guy like even came, like for some odd reason, I guess pasta and pizza doesn't take too long, but like it was like your food's, it was, the food was delivered before in, sorry, I'm sorry too much. Before the Uber like Lyft guy arrived, so. And I, was, I didn't think too much of oh, because it's a quick ride. And the guy, they said that the Lyft driver would be there. So I'm like, okay, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. But the Lyft driver literally took 20. He was like a... Oh my God, I'm so frustrated just thinking about it. He took 20 minutes to come to me. And I was like looking at the GPS. I was like, dude, you're on the wrong street. You're on the street like over. Like what don't you get? Oh, I don't know what to do. I was literally looking at the GPS. He's like, you're on the wrong street. Are you not using your GPS? He was on like the street over. And then I'm like, oh, now you're on like another freaking street. Like, what don't you understand? Use your GPS, bro. I don't know. Anyway, so like he would have been to me, but because he went down the wrong street or he just like, and I don't know if you know, like the West end of downtown Vancouver, but there's like, one way, but I don't know, but there's no, no excuse for that. Sorry. There is no excuse for that behavior. 
use a GPS, bro. It looked took literally took him 20 minutes. I'm not even exaggerating. 20 minutes. And he was just like, this street, that like are you joking? I was just looking at the GPS. So yeah, that was annoying. So whatever. I'm annoyed already, right? And I got my dog with me, whatever. She's vibing. We're, like, she was an issue. So I, I, but I don't know. I'm just I was so ir Okay, you get it. You get it. Anyways. So finally, uh, the guy comes. I get in the cab. And I'm in, or no, not the cab. The, the lift. And in the lift, I'm just like, dude, you know what? Uber would have been faster, okay? I was just like, I should just call an Uber, man. <sighs> Not sponsored, but... <laughs> and then, I'm I'm in the lift, right? And I remember... I'm My friend. My lives in a house with, like, um, several roommates. You know, it's like, kind of, people in and out, and I'm like, man. I really hope nobody eats my food because the guy, I remember I told the guy just leave it on the porch. I, I thought for sure I would get there before the food gets there, right? I'm like, just leave it on the porch and I get the text like even before I get into the, into the lift, I get the text like the food's on the porch. I was like, okay. So I'm in the lift, I'm just like, I hope his roommates don't find the food and eat it. Oh my God, I hope that. I, they would totally do that. My friend. Not there, right? To police the situation. Um, and then I remember. My friend. There has, um, there's like a pub. Like, su like, super close to his house. And we're like, oh shit, that place, it's open? Or, oh, it's nice. And then, so, so we're pulling in. The guy drops me off, right? I got my dog in her little bag. I'm like, yes. I'm gonna eat the food, you know? And I already get out, and then like I start to like walk up to the house, and then I see this movement. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, what is that? And then I'm just like, I, I see like these this movement, the scurrying back and forth. I'm like, oh, uh, like what? What? And I'm like, and I see there's fucking. A pack of rats, like, or mice and rats just scurrying around. I'm just like, oh, is that my food? Are they eating my food? I'm like, ah. And one thing you will know, like, I'm a, I'm afraid of mice. And if I'm afraid of mice, imagine how afraid I am of rats. And I'm just like frozen. I'm like, what the fuck do I do? I'm not gonna like walk up to the porch and walk into the house when there's like, and then I try to like kind of like move, walk down a little bit into like the front yard to like get a little bit of a better view. And I was like shook. I see all these rat like. Mm, like, it looked like, I don't know if there was mice or baby rats, but multiple of them. And then I saw big rats, like, scurrying. It's kind of like, there's, it's almost like a, like, there's like a balcony kind of thing. They're going in the bottom, and I can see, like, the silhouette of them. With, and there, my pizza lid is open, and I'm just like, oh my god. I just spent 70 fucking dollars on fucking... $20 on one pasta alone and they're just like the mice are just um, and I I'm afraid like I'm not gonna go up there and just like 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 the food the food's done like it's a write-off, right? What do I do? And I'm just like I'm frozen. I'm deathly afraid of rodents. I'm like, what do I do? I've got my my dog in this bag what do I do? My phone died just as I got out of the lift, and I'm like, and then I remember, oh fuck, the there there was the bar around the corner, so I I remember the bar, so I just like fuck, you, uh, fuck it, I'm going to the bar. <laughs> number one, I need a fucking drink. Number two, I'm gonna charge my phone, so I just like it's it's super close. Don't worry, I was fine.
So I like I walked I walk in there. I, I and it was the first time I've been to the bar since the corona, you know. So I like I sit I order up myself like a drink and I just like remember like thank god I had a charger on me because do you think in the time of corona people are gonna lend you a charger? Fuck no. Okay, so thankfully I had a charger on me. I'm like sipping my drink, plug my charger in, and I'm just waiting, 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 waiting on like and then like first thing I do as soon as I get some juice, my phone turns back on. I call my friend. And I was just like, dude, you will not believe what the fuck just happened. And I was telling him the story and like he told me that he had rats, but I didn't know it was like that. And then I, I called him and I told him the story. He's like, yeah, man, I told you. What do you think? You leave, how long, how long was it that the food was out there? And then I said, like, I don't know, like, maybe half an hour for me. He's like, of course they're going to eat it. I was just like, what? He's like, I told you. I said, dude, um, like, I know you told me, but I thought maybe you were exaggerating. He's like, I don't exaggerate. You exaggerate. <laughs> I was like, what? I was like, what? And I was like, I don't know what to do. He's like, oh. Just, just go back there. Just go through the like. Just go through the back door. I was just. I was like, bro, bro. I, I don't know. And I remember I called my mom. I had to tell her what happened. She was laughing her ass off. I was just like, I'm like. He's like, he's like, oh, 20 rounds. And like, I'm like, I'm not. I don't know the exact number, but there was a lot. There was a lot. Like, I'm, the food is a write-off, for sure. And I was like, one of the first things I did, too, is I went into the app, I was like, I did not receive that food, cause, and luckily they refunded me, because it's true, I'm not scamming them, I didn't receive the, like, I didn't eat it. Ugh. But luckily I got my money back for the food, because I was like, dude, that's a lot of money. It, it was a nightmare. And then, yeah, so I tried... So I, I, after the bar closed, I managed to get a couple drinks in, and I was like, oh, he's like, go through the back door, go through the back door. I was like, fuck, I'm still hungry, right? So I go through the back door, and um, I, I was in his My friend. room, and I was like, oh, fuck, I'm still hungry. So I ordered some kind of like fried chicken, Korean fried chicken thing, and then I just like, I remember I just didn't feel safe. I didn't feel like it was a safe space at that point. I was like, if I order food here, they're just going to come to the room. It's not safe. And then, like, I thought I heard something. And then I, my little, my little dog. If you see, watch my videos, my little baby dog. She, God bless her heart. She just always got my back. She chased, I felt like she ran out of the room and she was barking. I was like, oh my God, she's chasing something out of the room. I was like, I can't do this. I can't do this. So, literally, as soon as the food came, I called uh, an Uber. Because, yeah, Uber now. I called an Uber to take me home to New West, which is like a 20, 25 minute drive, 20 minute drive. I mean, I, yeah, so like I went home and then I just, I ate my food there because I, I didn't feel safe eating there. It's like, they've stolen enough of my food at this point. <laughs> and so yeah, so I go home and my brother, my friend, I ended up staying wherever he was. He was with like a friend he hadn't seen in a long time. The next day he called, he's like, where are you? Um, he's like, oh, no, I just went home. And then he's like, um, yeah, I looked at the food. Um, it doesn't look that bad. I don't think they, like, got into, uh, that much of it. I was like, uh, are you sure? Because they had, like, literally the pizza top open. He's like, oh, yeah, they only ate, like, maybe, like, uh, tops, like, one, two slices. And the rest looks, like, pretty okay. I was like, what do you mean? It looks okay. I was like, no, yeah, I think it's, like, okay to eat. I was like, uh, what? You think it's okay to eat? Yeah, yeah, I think it's fine. They didn't, uh, the stuff that was in, in a paper bag, I don't think they got into that. I was like, okay. And I shit you not, I was like, I asked him, like, did you eat that food? 
quiera. still here thank God thank you Jesus he's my best friend but I'm shook I guess that's it <laughs> hopefully that made you laugh because uh, the people I told it to in real life they laughed about it so I thought I had to share it to maybe hopefully make you laugh as well so if it did make you laugh Comment down below, and if you know which or I'm talking about it, mind your business. Keep that shit to yourself. I got many, many young boys, so nobody knows. <laughs> My mom said I should, I should uh, not name him, so I'm not. <laughs> I will remain nameless in order to protect the guilty. <laughs> Comment down below, and if you've ever had a pack of wild rats eat your food, please comment down below so we can relate to each other. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you're still here, you're a real one and catch you in the next one, hopefully. Bye. <laughs>